is Rocky. Her home is on the side of this river leading to Maxwell Falls in Colorado. Rocky lives with her family in a sedimentary rock on the river, but she's always wanted to explore the world for herself. She's been a part of this rock for so long, she forgot what life before being part of her rock was like. This is Hydro. As a water molecule, Hydro has traveled far and wide, running down rivers, snowing on the mountains, and condensing into clouds. His favorite adventure is soaring over the earth as part of a cloud community. The weathering process starts with precipitation when Hydro rains from the sky. Precipitation is water released from clouds in the form of rain, freezing rain, snow, sleet, or hail. Most precipitation falls as rain. In this diagram, a cloud with water vapor is precipitated and turns into rain, which falls towards the ground. Hydro's journey through the hydrologic cycle brought him down the same river that Rocky's home was located. Due to weathering by Hydro, Rocky breaks away from her rock family and sets off down the river. Rocky's adventure has brought her tumbling down the river in its suspended load. The journey of erosion is full of excitement for her. Erosion is the process by which water, ice, wind, or gravity moves fragments of rock and soil. Erosion begins at the bed load, but as more mass is weathered away, she transfers to the suspended load. The river displays a high level of energy since it is able to transport such a large particle. In this diagram, precipitation hits the side of the mountain, which breaks off a part of the rock and rolls down the hill. If Rocky wants to become cement someday, she needs to keep flowing down this river, despite its obstacles. Eventually, Rocky is deposited at the side of the river and must leave Hydro to continue his journey. In a clastic deposition, sediment erodes without being dissolved. The environment for Rocky's deposition is low energy. The information from brownness and size is Rocky is not very round, nor very small, so her journey was not very long. In this diagram, sediment is carried through a river and settles in a lake. This is the rock's new position, and this was the deposition of this rock. Rocky's adventure has been full of excitement, but it's not done yet. Her deposition has given her the opportunity to become part of a new rock through cementation and begin a new chapter of her life cycle. Lithification is the process by which deposited loose grains of sediment are converted into rock. Lithification may occur at the time a sediment is deposited or later. Cementation is one of the main processes involved, particularly for sandstones and conglomerates. In this diagram, a rock was deposited into a lake next to another rock. Over lots of time, these rocks had tremendous amounts of pressure pushing against each other and eventually converted into one rock. Just a few days after Rocky leaves, Hydro is again lifted into the sky through evaporation. Evaporation is the process in which water changes from a liquid to a gas or vapor. Heat is necessary for the process. Rising air currents take him as vapor into the atmosphere. In this diagram, heat causes water in a lake to heat up and liquid water will turn into water vapor through evaporation. After evaporating, Hydro condensed into a cloud and took his true place in the sky, beautiful and free.
Condensation is the process by which water vapor in the air is changed into liquid water. It is how clouds are formed and is the opposite of evaporation. Once enough water molecules come together, a cloud is formed and precipitation may occur. In this diagram, water from a lake is evaporating into the air, which condenses into the clouds.